Oh. Okay, draw and continue. <laughs> so this is a light sketch, and then Charlie's yep. gonna do a dark sketch so you can really see how he does it. Yeah. So first you're gonna draw like a little curve, then you're gonna draw the rest of the head, which is just kind of like a weird circle. Okay. Then you're gonna draw like a little curved line up to about like right here. And then you're gonna cur oh, and then in the middle of here, you're gonna draw one line here, and then draw another line right next to it, and then you're gonna color that in. And then you're gonna, from there, go up here to about right there, and you're gonna draw straight line. Then you're gonna go down again, and then you're gonna color that in. And then we're gonna do the same thing at the bottom, except not at the bottom, we're gonna do it up here. So we're just gonna kinda do it like this, continue the line, and then do that again on this side, and color that little line that you just made in colored in and then you're gonna kind of draw a rectangle like a round rectangle circle and then for his nose we're gonna draw a straight line up I mean kind of kind of like slanted almost like you're drawing an A it seems like yeah so kind of draw an A and then just like you draw an A except there's no triangle in the middle so draw a um, a bubble letter A, mm -hmm. just without in like a triangle in the mm -hmm. middle. Let me see right there. Yeah, there we go. It's a good picture of it there. Beautiful. Okay. Okay. So then, from the little thing here, we're gonna draw a line. That kind of curves, so it's kind of like he's smiling. Gotcha. So that's before you even draw the teeth. That's the first thing you do is that line yep. right there. Gotcha. Then you draw little round teeth. Nice. It's got the real skeleton feel to it here. Yeah, and then you're going to do the same thing on the bottom side. Mm. Like you did on the top. And then for his little pirate... um like bandana on the top of his head I here. Like his, I like his a lot of band there. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna um, draw like a kind of slanted straight line like that. Mm -hmm. Then we're gonna draw a half circle right here. So what are these, ha you yeah, see half circles and circles, what are those? Those are the little dots in his headband. Just like a design? Because if you see Just... like, if you see like pirates, sometimes they have like dotted hand headbands mm. and then you're gonna draw a full circle like that now can you use different colors but for this one you're just doing the tracing of the black so they can see it yeah would you would you do different colors in here or would this one be totally black uh what do you mean by that like would you color the bones or anything different oh no this is a black this is like one you would do just black yeah gotcha okay and then so once you got all your circles right here, okay, I'm just gonna write on our shoulder. We're gonna draw a little line right there, then a line right under it. Then we're gonna connect those two lines. Mm. And what's this piece here? Oh, this is the little tie. Around. That's the part that ties it to the head. Mm -hmm. gotcha. And then we're gonna draw something like that. Mm-hmm. Like a. S kinda. Kinda show that it's like waving. Like it's just kinda. And then we're gonna draw another one like that. So then that'll make the first part that he tied. And then for the second part, just go like right at the beginning and Boom. do like that. So and that's then the you head. Got a head. Yeah, you got a head right there. Nice. It's right? a good looking head. <laughs> then we are gonna do his neck bone right here. Neck bone. His neck. <laughs> his neck. Uh huh. 
So we're gonna just draw like a straight line on both sides and then we're gonna curve it like that. It's almost like a rectangle, just a little bit with rounded edges. Yeah. Then we're gonna draw just some lines. Okay, yeah, cool. So we're gonna draw this. So this is gonna be like his rib cage. Okay. So this is the part that connects his rib cage. So you're gonna draw like a curve right here. Right, okay. Like sort of the basically yep. the bottom of the neck. Mm -hmm. mm, nice. And then draw. So like this is curve and then just draw the rest of a rectangle. Mm. Then you got his little connector to his rib cage. Very cool. And then you're gonna draw a bone right there. It's just like a rounded thing. Then you're gonna draw one a little smaller than that. And then another one a little smaller than that. And just keep going in that pattern until you reach the bottom right here. So as big as your rib cage connector is, that's how many bones you can fit. Gotcha. But I can only fit like one, two, three, four, five. I can only fit seven. Gotcha. So you could make his rib, you can make his body there as long as you want it to be. Yeah. And if your feet like go off the page, that's fine. That's... <laughs> Sometimes that happens. It's, it's happened to me before. <laughs> so then you're going to do the same process on this side. Okay. Then you got yourself rib cage. Mm. Got yourself a body and rib cage. It's looking good. <laughs> it's looking real good. And then we're going to draw a heart with no point at the end. Gotcha. Then we're going to draw two straight lines and then another heart with no point. Mm. Like that. So that's like the start of that um, arm there to the yeah, that's elbow? Yeah, a, that's a arm bone right there. That's yep. Like, yep. And then we're going to do a circle okay. that re represents like this right here. Oh, let's see it. Got that. Oh, yeah, right okay. here. <laughs> okay, and then... Another little loop there. Oh, another little half heart. Another little heart yeah. with no uh, point. Gotcha. And then another two straight lines. Ooh. And we're going to straight line and connect it like that. Because this, this um, skeleton pirate, he doesn't look like he doesn't have a hand. Yeah, he doesn't have a hand. He replaced <laughs> it with a hook. Ooh, nice. Nice and touch. then you're gonna round it like that. Okay. Then draw a little rectangle. Gotcha. And draw like a curve that like, it's like a backward C. It almost is like a question mark, the top part of a question mark. Yeah, just make like a top part of a question mark with a point Boom. like that. Nice. And then you got yourself a hook. Nice. Looks really good when it's colored in like that. Thank you, sir. <laughs> then we're gonna draw another half heart and two lines. Then we're gonna connect it with another half heart. And- Cause really those half hearts show the beginning and the end of the bone, right? Yeah. Gotcha. Then we're gonna draw another circle, okay. like we did here. Yep. Then we're gonna draw another bone with no point. Yeah, and two straight lines. No point, yeah. yeah. <laughs> And then this side, he actually has a hand. Okay. Now he doesn't have to have a hand. You can draw whatever you want, huh? Yeah, he you can, yeah. Put a sword in that hand. Yep. But for me, I'm just going to go like that. He's got to have so, some kind of hand for you. He's got to have a, got, What is he going to eat with? You know what I mean? Yeah. This is hook. This is hook. He's just going to nom, nom, nom. <laughs> It's going to be very difficult. So you're going to draw, like, I don't know what this is. It's like a straight line and then curve it down to end make it pointing to the bottom right here is that his thumb that is his thumb. okay and then we're gonna draw one right here so it's like the same thing except longer than the thumb then another one right there and that and then that draw four of them and connect it right here yeah, zoom in for you just because i want to want to get it nice and clear there you go now you can see and if your pencil is like shh, getting it, then you can just close your pen really quick and uh, you get your pencil, which I don't, I have not, I don't have that many erasers. I found one. Okay. Found a pencil with an eraser, and you can just like 
erase. Oh, I see. The pencil. So, so. Well, you got some pencil marks, maybe. Yeah, you can erase it and like. Because your pen or your your marker that you use might be a little thicker than like your actual pencil. Yeah, line. so you have to draw it bigger, probably, and there's probably gonna be pencils. Some, so. Some pencil marks still there. Yeah. So you erased them, and now you don't see the pencil marks. I was about to draw with my pencil. Nice. Okay. Okay, so then we're gonna draw a half circle right here. Okay. Then we're gonna draw draw two half circles in it. Okay. Then we're gonna go down here. This is just like a little curve again. And then we're gonna do the same thing over here on both sides. Then we're gonna go in like that. Okay, dokie. And then we're gonna draw another bone, so just a heart with no point. Then do two straight lines. Go an upside down heart with no point. Nice, mm -hmm. very good. And then a circle to represent your knee. And then we're just gonna draw a little bone like that. Then we're gonna draw a straight line like right under it, except bigger. Then we're gonna curve it up like that. Then we're gonna draw a slightly slanted line. Mm, Cause you want it to go from thicker towards the top to smaller at the bottom? Yep. Okay. And then we're gonna draw a little straight line like that. So it's gonna look like a square at the bottom. Okay. And that's his peg leg. He lost Ooh, his leg. He lost his leg. A shark He lost off. his left hand and his right foot. Yep. All right. And then you're gonna draw another bone, so another heart with no bottom, or no point. And then an upside down heart with no point, like that. Then another circle to represent the knee. Then he's got another bone, and that's his half. That's the halfway bone. It's like half. That's like your bone. shin bone. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna draw a little curve like that. And then you're gonna draw a little bottom. And you're gonna go out like that. And then just color that in. Then and you'd what be is, done. And that's his foot? Mm-hmm, then you'd be done. Wow, let me get a good zoom in on that. That is perfect. And then, like you said, you can go over that and you can erase. Yeah. You can even just, even if you wanted to, you can just erase with the pencil over the whole thing. Mm-hmm. Cause obviously it's not gonna get the marker off. And you can put color onto this too. I just leave. You got a name life. for this guy or no name for him? No, he's a pirate skeleton. Pirate skeleton. I gotcha. don't know his exact name. I just. But yeah, he's done. He's done. Then you can color it whatever you want, whatever you want. Mmm, if you want to. If you want to. Fantastic, pirate skeleton. Yay! First drawing. There'll be more to come. Yes, definitely.